Welcome to our three-part series on getting started with Healthly. These videos will help you set up your account and learn best practices in utilizing the platform to manage your business and build relationship with your clients. This is part three, making the most of Healthy. In this video, you'll learn how to set up your discovery call or free consultation, customize notifications that you and your clients receive, connect intake forms and charting templates with smart fields, set expectations with your clients, and identify how you will use reports. By learning and applying these topics, you'll feel comfortable adding your clients and setting them up with healthy accounts to facilitate a strong ongoing relationship. First, we are going to discuss setting up a discovery call within your healthy account. We will show you how to do so within your calendar and packages and share our best practices for discovery calls. Many providers offer a discovery call or a free consultation session that can be used to assess fit for further work with pros prospect clients. Healthy makes it easy for you to create your discovery call or free consultation, as well as help you generate a shareable link to promote the offering. This link can be added to your website, included in an email signature, and added to any other digital marketing material. To create a free discovery call, navigate to your calendars tab, and on the right-hand side under more, select appointment type. First, you're going to create an appointment type of an initial appointment or discovery call or 15 minute intro session. Be sure to indicate whether you like this to be a phone call or a video call. Once you create the appointment type, next navigate to billing client packages, and create a package for the discovery call. We recommend giving it, giving it the same name as your appointment type and set the billing frequency as a one-time payment of $0 so that clients are not charged. Be sure to include the discovery call one credit so that the client can scheduled for that specific appointment type. Once the package is built, select share to add the link to your website or any social media platform. Best practices for discovery call. We recommend creating a group for your discovery call so that client so that you know who those potential clients are. To create a group, select the Clients tab on the left-hand side of the navigation bar, select Client Groups, and create a group for discovery calls or new potential clients. Your clients will not see the name of their group. After creating the group, we recommend assigning that specific group an intake flow. Many providers would provide an introductory call in their intake flow where they set expectations and go over what a discovery call looks like. You can also add this information in the email template that the client is going to receive when they sign up for your discovery call. To locate the email templates, navigate to your gear in the upper right-hand corner, select settings. On the left-hand side panel underneath features, you'll have select email templates. With scheduling and maximizing your time and workflow, you can adjust your calendar when you want to specifically take discovery call clients. Some providers find a disjointing switching gears from taking discovery calls to having a follow-up call right after with a client in a day. You can dedicate a certain day or time when you want your clients to book a discovery call. This is a special request you would need to reach out to us to adjust your calendar. By hitting the help button in the lower right hand corner, just ask a member from our team and we'll turn on this feature for you. Next, we will discuss how to customize the notifications that you and your clients receive. 
Healthy's platform automatically sends you and your clients emails and push notifications to keep you updated on client activity, account activity, and business needs. Email notifications are sent to your email address on file and push notifications are sent through the mobile app to notify you of updates and actions. To adjust your notifications, navigate to the ear the gear icon in the upper right hand corner, select settings. On the left hand side under personal, select notifications. Best practices, we recommend turning on all of the notifications for your clients, especially goal and appointment reminders. This is very important, especially when you are inviting clients onto the platform where you want them to get in the habit of utilizing Healthy and utilizing the app daily. So by turning on the bells and whistles, we'll keep them accountable for. Next, we will discuss how to sync your intake forms and charting templates with Healthy Smart Field feature. We will discuss what smart fields are, best practices for converting your intake forms to charting templates and creating intake flows. Healthy's intake form and charting template tool contain smart fields, which are autofill feature that connect connects the intake form responses within the client's profile and charting template fields to prevent providers from having to input the same piece of information more than once into the portal. This saves you and your clients time collecting client information and smart fields span client information, financial data, insurance information, and health fields. To locate the health fields, navigate to forms, form builder. You can either create a new form or select a form that is already created. On the left hand side, you will notice a bank of questions. By changing the category to charting or client info, here are the different smart fields that will autofill into the client's profile and other areas in the platform. In terms of best practices, one of our tips is to convert your intake form to a charting template where you can pull in your client's responses into your charting template. This will not affect your intake flow. However, it will minimize the amount of work during charting. What happens is that once a client fills out their initial paperwork, you can view their responses under charting and then add additional notes to that form where the client doesn't see this. Essentially, you don't have to recreate the note, but elaborate the information that the client input, which would save you time where the client completed your charting template for you, essentially. To get this started, select the intake form that you would like to convert into a charting form, select options, and select convert to charting form. Next, we're gonna go over best practices when setting up intake flows. On the left hand side of your navigation bar, select forms, select intake flow. On average, providers will have about six to seven forms in their intake flow. Out of the six to seven forms, we recommend adding in the welcome message, which greets your clients to the platform, letting them know they have forms to fill out. You are able to edit this message by clicking on the pen add any additional information, and then select update welcome message. Some providers will incorporate an introductory video that clients receive when they first sign up with them through the online portal. These videos are customized to the specific needs of your business and showcase how you plan to engage with clients on the platform. Next, we recommend having a health assessment form a questionnaire that acts as your clients for general lifestyle and health habits. We also recommend adding the HIPAA agreement, which is a private privacy policy form that informs your clients how you protect their information and ensure that you won't be sharing their information without their approval. We also recommend adding a cancellation policy form, which is an agreement for your clients to sign, understanding your office policy, which includes charges for no-show fees and cancellations. 
We also recommend adding a billing info form, which requests your clients to enter in their credit card information so that you can um, securely keep on file where you can charge them for those no-show um, or cancellation fees. And then lastly, we recommend for those of you that are taking insurance, adding in the insurance form, which requests the client to enter their in insurance information, which you can use that. And it also will autofill into the CMS 1500 when you create a claim. Next, we will discuss setting expectation with your client. We all know client engagement can take a lot of time answering messages, checking entries, viewing goals and metrics, which helps the client stay successful and stay accountable for. However, it's time consuming for you. We will discuss why you should add client engagement to your packages and best practices for having this discussion with your client. Make sure you build these client engagement tools within your packages. Be upfront about it. Ask yourself, does it include once a week journal reviews or daily reviews? You will want to communicate how often you plan to check journal entries and respond to chat messages, as well as offer these services, services as part of a premium package versus being available to all. Incorporating chat into your workflow can be a powerful way to stay engaged with client in between sessions, as well as securely discussing health information. Many providers also use the chat platform to discuss appointment logistics as it is often faster than email and or co phone conversations back and forth. As for best practices, we recommend discussing this with your clients during their first session with you. You can also create a video sharing your screen of your test client account, going over the features on Healthy you would like your clients to focus on. You can do the recording either on Zoom or even on your phone. Once you have the recording, convert the file to a URL link and add it to a form in your intake flow. This will add a personal touch, building a personal connection with your clients, making them feel comfortable working with you. Lastly, we will discuss Healthy's report feature. We will talk about the capabilities within the feature, how to access your reports, and best practices for using the feature. Healthy's reports make it easy for you to pull in information related to client information activity, client's metric and health outcomes, client uh, appointment history and statuses, payment information, and for organizations, understanding each provider's performance, track CMS 1500 claims that were created, and organization accounting by a particular provider. To access reports, navigate to reports on the left-hand side of your navigation bar and select the report you would like to download. You'll notice at the top there will appear a bar letting you know that the report is being generated in your documents folder. It will take about 30 minutes to generate the report. You can click on the link where it takes you into your documents tab into the generated reports folder. Once the report is generated, select the three dots next to the CSV file in documents and click on download. Best practices with reports, uh, pull up your client's name and email addresses report if you're creating a marketing campaign sending a newsletter. Or maybe going through the appointments report, which will allow you to view all of your no-shows or cancellations, or maybe you need to charge those clients. Or maybe you need to check in um, those clients who you need to follow up with with additional support. Also check in your payments report. Check in to see which packages are popular and what's the least pop. You can create promotion codes um, for the unpopular packages. Thank you for watching part three, making the most of healthy. Be sure to check out our other getting started videos to help you set up your account. You can find additional resources to help you make the most of your healthy membership here.